Hey guys, this is Trey Starry, and this is our episode of Hunting for Hackers 2. Um, so, this is now on CTF, I am Mage, and I am completely stupid. This guy, in the, and actually flew by my face, and I didn't see him, so, this is actually gonna not only be a Hunting for Hackers, it's gonna double as the Hacker Report. So, as you can see, I'm playing as Mage, because, well, look out. And then I kill him. That's pr that was pr that was pretty epic. Um, and I'm lagging a bit right now. So, uh, it's a fight. Pretty boring fight because it's mage. Oh yeah, I get gang banged here. It's hot. Um, then I throw ice and they all get like stuck. It's that was pretty sweet. Oh, and then there's a mage. And the mage gives up. So I'm just going to run and see who's actually intent on killing me, and I'll just kill them. And then if they get too close, I'll do that. <clears throat> okay. And I died, because I got gang banged. That's hot. Oh, and yes... It this, I'm recording the same day as I recorded <coughs> episode one, so you can kind of tell my voice is still bad. It's even worse now. So sorry if I'm quiet or scratchy sounding. Let's have tomorrow off. Um. All right, let's go fight this guy. I think I kill him here. Yeah, I kill him right here. Right there. There we go. Um, he failed, but then I'm gonna fail too. Right here, and I'm on fire. But for that, we have our trusty uh, heal spell, and it didn't last that long. Thank goodness. And right here, I'm like, yep, I'm missing. So I'm on fire, and I get regen. And I'm checking Skype as we speak. So. <coughs> I'm just messing around. Someone's listening to something in this accent in the other room. Um, I'm getting whacked now. Oh, this guy is a pest. He will continue to target me for the whole game. And I'm that guy, the archer there, I just saw his name. He's gonna be instrumental. He's the first one who notices the hacks. Um, unfortunately, he didn't give me enough information, so. I wasn't really able to tell him. He just walks by me. This guy just walks by me, so I'm killing him. Yep. So I get whacked by this guy. He was annoying. I'm getting killed by a ninja now, aren't I? Leave a dead on ninja. Yeah. <coughs> I checked Skype again. Sorry about doing that, but that's just what ends up happening because I have Skype and it's annoying and. Yeah. So I'm gonna see if I can. I wonder if he's. Is that him? No. Let's <coughs> see if I can find Kubaka. Oh, I just saw him. He was there. He's there. He's that archer. See if I can get more evidence. He's that archer. Not that archer. There's the archer. Um, you get a shot at him. You can see the hex, and then he gets auto man. That's the proof. Um, I'll point it out when it comes. And it comes hard. Sorry about that. I had to. Um, that's, this is one issue I have with this map, is the fact that you cannot get from the middle to the outside, whatsoever. Except for the bridges, which really shuts the game down, to be honest. And then, yeah, this is the guy who's instrumental. Not that guy, that guy's... So boring. Alright, we're almost at the part where he acts. 
He's gonna say heavy in a few mi a few seconds or a few minutes. I'm not sure which. I think right here. Um, and that's him failing at switching to heavy. So we know he's gonna be a heavy when he does this. Oh, hi there, hi Avery. You can die now. Yeah, you died. And I didn't get a chance to. Oh, I'm gonna lag now, aren't I? I'm gonna lag. Still just hitting people. Hitting people. Hitting people. I think I uploaded the wrong file. Oops. Oh well. Now I'm lagging again. Oh, this part. I fried, I ran out of region so I couldn't do anything. It's embarrassing. And then I freeze this. And then that soldier decides it's a beautiful time to come kill me. There we go. He says heavy. Right there. We know he's a heavy. Um. And now, let's see, I'm gonna try pausing it. Let's shut off. Oh yeah, it does. Sorry, I'm gonna have to connect these two. Um, that might actually take too much time. Oh well, that's unfortunate. So. A headshot, boom. I'm gonna have to deal with this guy. What if I get him? But that's nothing apart. Yeah, right here, I get him. He, here, he's calling hacks. He calls hacks. So, when you see hacks, you have to I believe it's hacks, and right here, across the sky, here he comes. Look for the heavy. Looks like he's across the sponge, but he goes a little bit too. There he is. Superman! If you didn't see that, refresh it. Right there. He goes, the sponge way overshoots. And that is not, that's too far for an overshoot, considering it goes in a com complete L direction. If you don't see it, replay that. But it's pretty funny. And he's going to steal one. Five, four, three, two, one... Negative one, negative two. <laughs> there, no. It's just gonna be in a few minutes or seconds because this isn't very long. See, he steals. Here comes the hex cries. And boom. I'm really bad. I'm really bad at my timing. Auto band. Dropped it. So, I'm gonna go back and see if I can. I don't know if you can see the actual name. But it's proof you got auto banned. Oh, no, yes, because he's calling hacks. He says, oh, wow, ha, he got kicked. Um, let's see if Blockmaster says something else. Ha, 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 yeah, see, that's the right guy. So, they're all, that's kind of, it's not the best evidence, but you can see him flying. You can see him get auto banned, and you can see the opponent's reactions. So, I kind of feel that's enough proof. If not, if you're the mod checking this, please check the Automans, because he is, um, well, it's pretty obvious. I feel it's obvious. You can't really tell, but it, you can, can't see the name, but you can see what people's reactions are, and it looks pretty strong case. Especially with the Autoban on CTF being one of the best of your game modes. So, that is episode two. Thank you, and have a nice day.